So one of the problems we've heard complaints about is that uh, 3M's vinyl actually only comes in 48 inches wide. Um, so there's a technique called splicing, which we can use to, um, I guess, basically minimize uh, the seam in extending uh, a size of the vinyl. So I'm going to show you how to do that in this video. So basically, um, pretend that <clears throat> you've already installed uh, you know, one piece of vinyl and you want to extend it to be a little bit wider. So what you would do is you would take your second piece. Sorry, get this going. And you would match up the pattern, but you actually want to uh, overlay it uh, you know, by maybe half an inch or so. And so you see here that uh, the pattern does go and it extends, but you have a seam and like it's overlaid over top. Um, so what you want to do is actually take like an X-Acto knife, basically. Uh, you don't want to cut all the way where the other one's underneath, but maybe in the, in the middle of both of these, um, all the way down. And so you will pull the part on the left off, and then you'll want to lift up this side. And you'll want to pull the part on the bottom out. and then put this back down. So what that actually allows you to do is create this seam that matches the pattern but without having one overlay over top of the next or essentially right next to each other. So as you can see, there is still a seam but you only see it at the right angles and that's basically as good as you can get in terms of extending the width of the 3M carbon fiber die knock.